Coming up next, uh, beautiful sculptures created using a revolutionary technique developed by a husband and wife team. We're going to meet the creators in just a bit. She was a former Taiwanese film star in the 70s who won two Golden Horse Awards in her movie Heyday. As some viewers may remember, Loretta Hui Shan Yang in movies like The Young Runaway and Jade Love, which was directed by Chang Li, whom she married. Well, these days, both of them are better known not for the art of movie making, but for reviving a dying art, Liu Li, or Chinese glass art. That's right. This is an ancient Chinese glass sculpting and design, which is created under extreme heat and in crystal clear forms. Well, to tell us more about this, we have Loretta and Changi themselves in the studio. I think we kind of embarrass you by introducing <laughs> you like that. Well, warm welcome to the studio. Welcome. So a lot of people actually do recognize you, um, you know, to be in the movie industry, but you've moved on and you've gone into the glass making uh, art <laughs> industry. Well, what was this motivation for you to transition to a very different medium? Yeah, I think it is a state because in our last movie, Zhang Yi, the director, of course, okay. uh, Your husband. brought many, <laughs> yes, brought many foreign artists piece of work mm -hmm. and uh, as a props for the films. Mm. That's a, I first time lay my eyes on such a artworks. And uh, I, I never thought one can turn crystal or glass right. into art. That's very attracting me. So, mm -hmm. and uh, I think another very important reason was, uh, according to all we gather informations, there were no Chinese artists in this glass making feel. Right, so it's so. a dying tradition sort of and you are hoping I guess to inject life into it? Yes, mm -hmm. because they are, well anything you're going to do, you will be the first one, yeah that would be uh, exciting. Uh -huh. <laughs> well, I guess what you're <laughs> known for those... Is I think yeah. it began as well. The nightmare. Oh, the yeah. nightmare. Yeah. Oh, okay. Yeah, with, it, yeah. with anything new and exciting, there's always some challenges. <laughs> yeah. Sure. I mean, but we understand that you use a, a very ancient uh, form of uh, glass uh, making, mm -hmm. glass sculpting. Mm -hmm. I mean, tell us more about that. There's something that hasn't been done for many years. Yes, uh, because the, uh, you know, and when we uh, first involved the uh, glass, we just have to find the exact language can you know satisfy yourself and how to express your your idea. Uh -huh. The bad event at that times we thought that's the uh, only technique anyway, we can yes. you know we can use it. Actually, the bad event means the uh, wax loss casting. Right. You can have uh, all the detail you like to have. Well, that's the only uh -huh. technique we can have. Well, what yes. is this technique actually? I mean, how, how is it done in, in very simple terms? I'm trying to understand what, what the technique actually can uh, you know, help you create. <laughs> in the simple mm. <laughs> okay, it's not that simple, all right. Uh, okay, it involves 12, roughly 12 uh -huh. altogether, uh -huh. 12 steps. 12 steps, uh -huh. yes. And basically, it's the most very most uh, time consuming and the most complicated. Right. So is it like we've seen people blowing the shape of a glass? I mean, is it something totally different? That's a very different. different. That's a very different. So what yes. do you, what happens in your twelve steps? Give us some examples. Okay, for instance, if you like to have a, a vessel, you can blow. Uh -huh. But how can you have a, you know a sculpture like this? Like gesture, uh -huh. that is. Right? How because do you create those? Yeah. How can yeah, you yeah, sculpt yeah, it and as the glass is still very hot, uh -huh. very soft? Right. The bad divide, the wax loss casting, I think that's the only method you can achieve this. So basically it's a method that allows you to create shapes and sizes Shape, the way detail. you want. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Exactly. Uh, what about the color? I mean, you know, some of your, your products are beautiful colors. Uh, uh -huh. How is that injected into it? I think we produce the color crystal. Actually, uh, we call Liu Li because it's the some, something is significant for, for us. But, right. uh, Actually, as a material, is a same, is a crystal, mm -hmm. so glass. We or glass. Mm -hmm. So we produce the color crystal, and you can position all the color the, uh -huh. to the precisely the position you like to have. Right. And all those color actually just come from metallic oxide. Mm. Use the uh, oxide; you can have any color as you like. For instance, the uh, copper you can have red. I use the uh, what the iron. You can uh -huh. have a green. Right. Yes. Well, uh. I, I I've uh, actually seen glass uh, blowing techniques uh, in, in you know some factories that 
open houses. No. So I went to have mm -hmm. a look, and I, I understood back then that it's a very delicate art and very difficult because um, for the glass blowing technique, mm -hmm. you mm -hmm. you create you a product and you can't stop. Pie. There's yes. no such thing as putting two together. So mm -hmm. it's like uh, it's one ongoing process. What about this combination of technique? Does it allow you to have? Okay, we make this part of the yes. head first, mm -hmm. and then we make the tail, and then we put it together, or is it yeah. all in one block? So you you had to control the very different technique for for each uh -huh. for petve and the blowing glass right. and uh, we use uh, we call the hot applied to group them together to, together. Oh. Together. but mm -hmm. I think and the most important yes. things you have the, uh, your training a very good team the very team mark, that is the uh, so right. the Lord had you train the team as a member of six. They work together for more than uh, eight years already. Just mm. try to, you know, achieve the uh, exactly the design Lord right. I like to be. Because you can see the size over right. there is a pretty yes. long and pretty heavy. Uh -huh. right. And uh, you use the the blowing pipe is a uh, 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 the one point five meter longer. Yeah, okay. yes. And yes. it's yes. hot. Right. And it must be very strong. You, you have to to rotate to rotate yeah. to. To, to to keep the shape not exactly. change, so it's a very physical challenge. <laughs> yeah, I mean, it's and the no air condition right. in our workshop oh, at okay. all. Okay. I mean, yeah. it's yeah. labor have. intensive. So, exactly. how long does it take for you to create a, a product like this one? And uh, you know, I have to make it in very short time. Mm -hmm. That's most very really difficult part. Right okay. before the but otherwise so the, the I, piece will crack the, the, immediately. The, the, my teams must have uh, control very well and uh, right. very skillful for, uh -huh. for the process. Okay, they must yeah. be very well, have practiced many times with many, yeah, doing exactly. it many, many, many times over and over yes. again. Right. Okay, well, if we're just looking at it. I mean, I, I will now appreciate these uh, vases more when I see them because I've always thought they just come from a factory where they just kind of <laughs> I know, put in a mold and you just come center. out and, yeah. Yeah. and, you, and they tell you how much it costs. And you're like, why would I pay that much? But now I understand a bit more. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> All right, thanks for coming in this morning. Thank you. Us. Thank you, too. And that was former actress Laura Donghui Shan Yang and her husband Chang Li, who shared with us the art of Asian glass making or Liu Li. Um, if you want to find out more about this ancient art, Loretta and Chang Yi will be unveiling their Silent Within Fire collection at the Liu Gongfang Gallery at Paragon, Singapore. That's right.